Good morning, Azeroth. Good morning, Azeroth. This is Neil, your friendly warrior tank from Medivh, and I help people earn achievements, and this is Good Morning, Azeroth. Neil's attempt to bring you the news from all around the World of Warcraft 4, Tuesday, March the 14th, 2017. It's Pi Day, 3.14 day. Uh, welcome to a Good Morning, Azeroth. Today's top story is it's a new two weeks, and wow, it's a new two weeks, and wow, lots of new things going on these two weeks. First up, uh, an urgent warning. A new quest series starts from your class order hall. An urgent warning. The quest sends your followers on a mission to the Broken Shore, Menace on the Broken Shore, and Hope Betrayed, as well as the follow-up quest, Investigate the Broken Shore. It looks like we are getting the start of the pre-7.2 storyline now. Slow down, Blizzard. Slow down. Like the Pandarans say, slow down. I'm not ready for 7.2 many crickets slow down uh it's coming it's here go to your uh, class order hall and meet with the person there and uh do the quest on your mission table to start uh investigating the broken shore later this week later this week ungoro madness events friday and saturday the dinosaurs have already invaded hearthstone and on march 17th they are invading the world of warcraft during the event Players fight elite dinosaurs and collect Dino Mojo. The vial gives you an adaptation effect, which sounds similar to the adapt mechanic coming in the Hearthstone expansion. Uh, basically, you pick up Dino Mojo, which is a vial, and you throw it at another player to grant both them and you a random adaptation. Uh, so, sounds like some uh, some uh, the, the, the costuming or something going on. We're not quite sure yet because I haven't done this, but apparently we'll figure out Friday, Saturday. Also, there's a new question and answer session coming on Thursday. The Legion itemization question and answer takes place this Thursday, March the 16th at 11 a.m. Pacific time with lead game designer Matt Goss. Catch up on the latest gear itemization in Legion, uh, including adjustments to the legendary items, legendary armor, what's new in patch 7.2, and artifact weapons, what's new in patch 7.2. Submit those questions, you might get asked, on the Q&A Thursday at 11 o'clock. It is Battleground Bonus Event Week. Battleground Bonus Event this you this week you get the sign of the battle buff which increases the amount of honor earned from battleground objectives and wins by 50 percent uh of course honor is used to unlock more pvp talents when until you get to prestige one allows you to prestige up for rewards like the prestigious bronze courser and the alliance enthusiast horde enthusiast you get those enthusiast pets at prestige level one uh, Courser, I'm not sure, but uh, eventually you'll get it. Uh, pick up the bonus event quest from Archmage Tymir to acquire your Glory of the Melee Badge of Honor and five Marks of Honor uh, after you win four Battlegrounds. Uh, also, Season 3 starting soon. Season 3, so I'm not a PvP guy, but if you're interested, uh, check out all that stuff. Uh, next up, world boss is Sharthos. Sharthos is up this week. He can be found in Central Val Shirah. He's one of the 11 world bosses in Legion, dropping 860 chest, a cloak, Dang. decaying dragon. dragon fang, which is an 860 shadow relic, an amulet. Uh, it, defeating Sharthos is required for the world quest, the Sleeping Corruption, and counts towards credit for Unleashed Monstrosities. Unleashed Monstrosities uh, unlocks a, uh, a tent for your artifact weapon after unlocking the base, Valorious Artifact Appearance based on improving on history, which comes from the Balance of Power questline, uh, which requires you to go into Emerald Nightmare and Nighthold and collect some things uh, to finish that. Uh, also, Warriors, get your Skull of Sharthos, which is needed. It's one of three pieces needed for the Hidden Fury Appearance, the Dragon Slayers. Uh, so, Sharthos drops a piece, Nithog, or Nithog drops another piece, and our friend uh, God King Skobal drops the third piece, uh, randomly. Sharthos and um, the, the, the Nithog should drop it uh, pretty much if you've got your artifact knowledge high enough and you uh, have the reputations required. Uh, God King is random, lovely. Uh, you've got a new archaeology quest these two weeks, a beacon of hope, which rewards a not a toy starlight beacon. The starlight beacon allows you to draw the outline of a starlight field 
Players inside the Starlight Field can fly. It is not a toy. Uh, this week it does not say uh, that if you have already picked up a Starlight Beacon, if you'll pick up another, or if you would get Artifact Power. Uh, since it doesn't say, I imagine you pick up another Starlight Beacon, which can be sold for 10 gold if you don't want it. Uh, this uh, acquiring eight of the archaeology items from these bi-weekly quests uh, gets you this side up. Uh, acquiring all of them gets you another one, uh, and a special uh, the, this side up gets you a special artifact. Yeah? Uh, our friend Cosmoth uh, Cosmoth this week is a rewarding the pet. If you have not picked up your pet from Cosmoth, uh, go check out Cosmoth the Hungering. If you have not attuned Cosmoth yet, uh, go ahead and get your attunement done. Very easy these days. Very easily soloable. Uh, if you avoid the, the, the big mobs that can kill you, and they are avoidable. Uh, lots of good guides on how to do that out there. Also today, BlizzCon 2017 dates were revealed, November 3rd and 4th. Uh, ticket sale days were announced as well. They go on sale 7 p.m. Pacific Time on April the 5th and 10 a.m. Pacific Time, April the 8th. The benefit dinner tickets are $750 and go on sale 7 p.m. Pacific on the 12th. Uh, so, get your tickets to BlizzCon, re reserve those hotels, get ready to go. BlizzCon is coming. If this video helped you out, go ahead and like and share the video, subscribe to the channel. Uh, those things help us out. If it didn't help you out at all, go ahead and downvote the, the heck out of it. Appreciate that. Uh, also, this is the second time recording this because Neil had technical issues the first time because I had the wrong microphone turned on. Uh, something's taking over the computer. Weird. Also, uh, keep up with me in all the ways. Keep up with me in all the ways. We're streaming live on Twitch right now. Twitch TV. The Neils go to stream. Throw up a follow. Appreciate the follows. Also, we're on Open Raid. All of the achievement runs are on Open Raid. Open Raid. Zerg ID. Dot com. Uh, if you are interested in achievements, keep up with me there, openread.zergid.com. Also, I'm on Facebook, I'm on Twitter, I'm on YouTube. I follow back, I friend back, I subscribe back if you look like a content creator. And I'm in a guild, shatteredfates.com is the website. Shattered Fates on Medivh is the Alliance Guild. Shattered Fates on Exodar is the Horde Guild. We have both. You can join either. We are more Alliance than Horde, really. Uh, the Horde Guild is really just there for people who have both to put their uh, Horde tunes. Uh, but if you want to join our guild, let us know. If you're looking for a guild, we're looking for you. Also, um, I'm on Patreon. Patreon.com. The Neils. That's where people are helping Neil help other people earn more achievements. We appreciate them all. For as little as two bucks a month, you get thanked every time you do a program and get cool rewards over there at Patreon. Patreon.com. The Neils. Thanks to the patrons. They make this possible. Regnava, Zuki, and the Random One, Neil, Adafluzi, Tinder, Mulva, Ocean Captain, Holy Fox, Sinner, Carl, Lucky Bee, Infinitron, Darla, Saika, Mystery Patron, that could be you, Shigan, Fentheria, Equin, Ucha, Marasha, Petsy, The Beer Guy, Lean Beef, Coco, Naughty, Dwarfy, Azurea, Noses, J. Divine, Shimei, Fuggle, Delthanor, Tiger Song, Leia, Bell Whip, Cluck Dog, Mystery Patron, that also could be you, Mystical, Zelo, Kalai, Jedi, and Aramava, they are all helping Neil, help other people learn more achievements. We appreciate them all. Y'all have fun storming the castle today, and remember, fire is still bad. This X-Pack, y'all have a great one.